This is the Velo Mini. It comes in a whole bunch of different colors. It folds kind of a unique configuration. It's more flat than, than you know, cube-shaped, which is what a lot of the other uh, smaller folding e-bikes look like. There's uh, a comparable bike is the Bob battery-operated bicycle by Amazing Innovations. Um, and it, like I said, this is the e-Velo Mini, so it's a little different. As you can see, it's all folded right now. I'm gonna go ahead and try to unfold it with one hand. You can kind of see the hinges picking up in the middle right here. Go ahead and tap that back in. There we go. And down here, kind of, let's see, get the cables all right. Pull up like this. Mini when it's all opened up, ready for riding, and as you can see, it's got this nice triangle support in the back, the seat that kind of angles backwards, which is, which is really nice. It gives you a little bit, you know, more of a gap here when you're riding, which feels really nice and natural. Um, it's pretty minimal. I mean, this is this design. There's no gears or anything. It's just a, a single speed down here, but it actually feels pretty good, and it's got both pedal assist and throttle mode, which is cool. So as soon as you get on this thing, um, you, you turn the battery on, and then you turn the uh, system on here with this button. When you start pedaling after a couple of rotations, it kicks in and assists you. Uh, now it's only a 24 volt battery, and the motor here is only 180 watts, which is at the extreme low end, but this thing only weighs uh, like 33 pounds, so it's pretty pretty light, you know, and, and that means that the motor doesn't have to move as much weight. So if you're not a huge rider and you're not going up big hills, it's going to be plenty, and especially in pedal assist mode, and that's going to extend your range. Um, alternatively, it actually does have a twist throttle. Now you can see I'm twisting and it, nothing is happening. It's got kind of a safety thing built in where you have to be riding a little bit for that to kick in. Um, but again, you know, you, you actually get a decent range and uh, quite a bit of support from that little little motor. And the battery is, is built right into this, I guess you would call it like a down tube um, right here. And you can see the, the charging slot right there. So it's, you know, it's kind of a quirky little bike, but if you're short on space, it could be just what you're looking for. Um, and again, it folds up real nice. There's even like a backpack thing you can buy that's specifically made for this. You can carry it around. And I didn't show it before, but this thing pops up and the handlebars come out and fold down to the side. So it gets just super compact. And this is very, very easy to lift. Some of the, the other things that I really like is it's got a nice little sort of uh, light back here and two little mini fenders in case it's damp outside. You've got a V-brake right up in the front and in the back you've got a, a little drum brake and they both work pretty well. The uh, the brake levers here also cut power to the motor so it's it's pretty, you know, it's pretty fully featured. This thing's going to work pretty well and it's got a nice little metal loop here which is going to help uh, protect the bottom and, and give you something to rest this on when you when you fold it up so that you aren't banging too much on the on the chain ring, but that does actually have sort of a little plastic protector. And as with a lot of uh, folding electric bikes, these pedals here, um, you can kind of pull it out and then it flops down to the side. Let's see if I can, I don't, I'm having trouble with one hand, but essentially those, those fold down too, which gives you a even more compact footprint. And that's really what this bike is all about. Um, you know, I, I'm not sure I would want to ride this over huge distances. You're going to be kind of going up and down on the bumps and super teeny tiny 12 inch wheels here but it gets the job done it's way better than walking and you know you can easily take this on the bus and it, with more and more people biking you know the the front of the bus might be taken up or you might not be someone who wants to lift a whole bike up there this is a good solution so i'm gonna go ahead and hop on this and you can uh, see what it's like to have it kick in pedal assist mode and then i'll show you throttle mode so again i'm turn it on i'm getting ready to pedal take a couple strokes motor kicks in. So, you know, no problem. It's actually a good amount of, a good amount of torque that that little motor puts out.
And again, the diameter of the wheel is, is pretty small, so it's not like it's, it's having to do as much work. Yep. Now I'm gonna switch to throttle mode here. Whoa, going over some bumps. Again, with these little wheels, the bumps are, you know, you feel them a little more. There we go. And there you have it. Woo. And that is the Velo Mini. <laughs> For the full written review, pictures and comments and stuff, check out electricbikereview.com. See you there.